What's up my real ones? Welcome back to my channel. On today I will be eating Outback Steakhouse. I'll be trying the blooming French onion steak. So let's get into it. So so that's the steak. That's the steak. It's topped with pomblone cheese and blooming onions. I also have some um, Outback mac and cheese. This is a sauce for the steak, and I got some bread on the side. All right, so y'all, let's get into the video. So what's up, y'all? I hope everybody's doing great. Hope you're having a great day. And they making cheese is really good. This is actually new on their menu. That's steak. So y'all, I have a trip that's coming up real soon to go see Bay in Atlanta. Time passed by so fast. so bad. That date got here before you know it. Y'all got a scenario for y'all. I have a friend that's newly engaged. 
is a female. She knew to engage. And she recently moved in with her boyfriend, with her fiance. One night, she was talking on the phone to one of her male friends. <clears throat> and when they ended the conversation, the male friend said, I love you. And she responded, I love you too. When she got off that phone, her fiance was pissed. Because she told another man, I love you. So what y'all think? Do y'all think it's inappropriate? Do we have a right to be mad? I do understand that, you know, people have their friends and they tell their friends, I love you. But at the same time, I feel that if that's how he feel, if he don't like it or it make him feel some type of way, she should be open to understand his feelings his point of view. If he don't like it, he don't like it. At the end of the day. So what you guys think? You Do you think he should not be mad over that because she telling a friend I love you? Do you think he's insecure? Or you see where he's coming from? Because if I can see where he's coming from, I really could. You know? Like I said. She should be able, in my opinion, to be open-minded to how her fiance feel, whether she agree, agree or disagree. That's how he feel, and he got the right to feel how he feel. And that's just that, you know? Also, that's how her fiance feels. She should respect that and simply don't say it anymore. Because I'm sure if Table would turn, if he felt some type of, I mean, if Table would turn and she felt some type of way about something, she would want him to Respect her feelings, right? <clears throat> so that's how I feel. That's my opinion on that. So what you guys think? Two people, right? Two people 
is in a relationship. My people allow their family members and their friends to be part of their relationship and out in their business. I don't like that. Cause that's called that cause problems in the relationship. Baltimore. I won't be able to deal with that. That's just too much. It's a thick steak. You hear me? It's the mud. It's thick. But when that friend told me that situation, I told her exactly what I'm telling you guys. Important. Some of the friends, you gotta watch some of the friends. Some of the friends be hating bad when you get into a relationship. Why? I don't know the reason why. Because I've never been one of those friends that be hating like they for example their friend one of their friends or ex friend whatever you want to call it say we talk too much Not making any time for your friends. Is that really the, the case, or you want more time? And then turned around and gave me an ultimatum. Tomato. And I 
I guess the ultimatum was like, it's gonna be him or me. Basically, in a nutshell. And what do you think that decision was? They felt good. Y'all, this meal was very delicious. Next time y'all out back, check it out. It's good. stop by and say hi and chat with y'all for a minute like comment subscribe press that bell be notified make sure you subscribe to my other channel all right see y'all in the next video this is